So I'm back today after being sick last week. Well, <coughs> I'm still a little sick, unfortunately. And I refreshed my hair today and my hands are blue. So ignore that throughout the tutorial. I just kind of came up with this look here. I don't know if it's been done or not, but whatever. It was fun. If you want to see how I got these eyes, then please keep watching. And thanks for sticking around even though I was sick last week. All right, let's get started. Uh, don't mind my blue hand throughout the tutorial. <laughs> I'm starting with Morphe's 35C palette and I'm taking that purple shade I'm pointing to and a Hakuhodo J5533, similar to a MAC 217. And I'm applying that to the crease area on the inner and outer thirds of my eye. And I'm just layering more product on. Next with my Morphe M441 brush, I'm using that to blend out any edges that I have. Next with my Cosmetics Pencil Brush, I'm taking more of that purple shade and applying that to the inner and outer thirds of the eye. And then blending that out with my Hakuhodo J5533 brush. So just putting, layering the product and then blending it out. Now I'm taking the darker purple shade in the Morphe 35C palette on the Cosmetics Pencil Brush and I'm applying that to the inner and outer thirds of the eye. And then I'm blending that out. Next with Morphe's Single Shadow in the shade Grape Day, on the same Cosmetics Pencil Brush, I'm applying that to the inner and outer thirds of the eye. I'm just creating a bit of depth and dimension. And then I'm blending that out with the Hakuhodo brush. Then I'm taking the white from the Morphe 35C palette on the Morphe M441 brush and I'm using that to blend out the crease shade. just felt like it needed some more blending. Next with the burgundy shade from the 35C palette on my Cosmetics pencil brush, I'm applying that to the inner and outer thirds of my eye. And then I'm blending that out with my Hakuhodo brush. Applying it on my other eye. And then blending. Then I'm taking that onto the lower lash line and connecting the two. Then I'm taking the Hakuhodo brush to blend out the whole eye so that it kind of seems more cohesive and not like I did the top and then I did the bottom. Next from my Morphe 35U palette, I'm taking that pearly peachy shade on a paintbrush that has been sprayed with Fix Plus and I'm applying that to the center of my lid. I'm using padding motions. Okay, also this morning I thought that my brows were so even and now I look at it and one looks really thin <laughs> compared to the other. Oh well, I'm taking more of that burgundy shade and I'm going over those edges there and blending. Now I'm taking Wildly Natural Cosmetics Blue Ice Pigment. I do have a discount code. I will list that in the description box below. And I'm using a Sigma E36 brush. And I'm applying that to the inner corners of my eye using swirling motions. Next, I'm taking Sephora 
lilac shimmer jumbo pencil and I'm applying that to my lower waterline and slightly on the lower lash line. And then I'm taking more of that peach shade and putting that directly in the center of my lower lash line. Next from my House of Lashes Precious Gem Lash Case, I'm using my House of Lashes Smoky Muse Lashes and I'm popping them on here. And these are the eyes done. And then for the rest of my look, I decided to go with this perfect nude lip, which is NYX Lingerie Lip in Corset. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one.